Hello everyone, welcome to Color Designs. Today we are going to learn a little bit about uh, transparency. Uh, transparency in uh, coral draw is very unique. So and we are going right ahead to learn about it. Uh, I will create two shapes for giving an example. I will fill it with colors, one with blue or maybe other one with red. Uh, okay, maybe purple. As you can see, the upper layer uh, is totally solid color, 100% pure, and uh, it doesn't have any transparency to it. Uh, uh, it's meant that you cannot see uh, behind uh, this layer. So I will apply transparency. I will select the purple layer and uh, click on transparency option. Then as you can see, there is a little uh, box appear at the bottom of this layer, and you will drag this point towards 10 or maybe 25 as much as transparency you need to apply on this layer. After that, you can see that transparency has been applied to my layer and uh, the design has become transparent. So you can move it around, put it anywhere you want. This is the first method of using transparency. I will put it right here and use the other transparency option. The other one, uh, transparency you use, is uh, simply to select your layer and by after selecting your transparency tool, you can click and drag on your layer. Uh, like this, the transparency will be applied to your layer or your shape. The white one, as you can see, contains the pure color and the dark one contains the transparency. So the one side will be transparent, the other side will be pure color. This is how the second way of using the transparency. You can put it right here and as you can see, it looks like there are two colors uh, merging together. This is the way of using and the second transparency. I will move it around. And uh, in further classes, I will teach you how to use, where to use um, transparency in your designs, how effective is uh, transparency. There are many other ways and many great ways to use transparency. For now, I will uh, try to demonstrate or give you an example of using transparency. I will convert this shape by pressing Control Q. After that, I will delete these two points or maybe select the whole shape and convert it to curve. Then I will bring this node upwards and delete these two nodes. After that, I will select, I will click on it and press uh, select the center and bring it to the bottom node and after that, I will make a duplicate of the layer and move the duplicate by pressing control, pressing and hold control, and press control D after that until your shape is completed. As you can see, my shape has been completed and it's totally um, beautiful as I think. The outline, you can remove outline by pressing uh, on the cross mark, right click on it and the outline will be removed. This is how you use uh, transparency to design a simple shape of flower. You can change the color, but the effect will remain. And the second way is uh, also the same. Press Control Q. I will bring it up and make uh, change the center point and bring it to the bottom and press Control D duplicate and move the duplicate and uh, until my Pressing Control D until my design has been complete. I'll select the whole shape and press Control G to make it one group. Remove the outline and here you go. Your design is complete. This is the second method to use transparency in your designs. This is the use of transparency. Hope you understand a little bit about transparency. Uh, just uh, try and if you have any questions, kindly ask them. I'll be happy to answer your questions.